I was trying to beat him for sure, but uh, but we had to get there first. And um, you know, once I pushed him out to the lead, the 99 was on my my side there, and uh, David had kind of got out, you know, enough of a lead that that I wasn't going to pass him. And, and there, at that point, I was just um, you know obviously trying to trying to finish second. So um, you know, we got hooked up. He, he's a great uh, restrictor plate racer. I've had some great finishes on restrictor plate races in the past, and um, you know, it just uh, you know I, I still. Still, obviously, uh, want to get that first win, but um, today wasn't the day. But uh, but we'll take second for sure, and, and and a first with our teammate. It's a big day. So, um, a lot of it had to do with this little note here. Good luck. This is from my daughter, ten-year-old daughter. She she wrote that and uh, and put it in. It's got a little horseshoe in it. Um, she she wrote that and put it on my dash there before the race. So she had some horseshoe good luck earrings in too. So um, we'll take it. What's your daughter's name? Taylor. Taylor Gilliland. She. Uh, She's not. She's been coming to the racetrack her whole life, but uh, she still she watches it from the motorhome. <laughs> how, how old is she? Ten. Ten years old. Okay. Well, good deal. These and, and the road courses we feel like are our best shots to come and and have a legitimate shot at, at winning. Um, the rest of our program we're still working on and trying to get there. You know, obviously someday we want to be an organization that can go and compete for wins on a weekly basis, but but we're not there yet. And um, so to be able to come to these type of tracks, we definitely put a lot of preparation into. Um, you know, and, and a lot of emphasis on our Speedway program. And, and today we had two very fast race cars, and, um, you know, we're able to come home one, too.